It's a good old fashioned box war coming up next on Beat the Odds Card Breaks. Hello, sport card collectors, and welcome back to another episode of Beat the Odds Card Breaks. We are going to go at it today with quite possibly my most favorite set from 2020, that being Top Stadium Club Chrome. Came out super late this year and has captured my heart. Uh, lots of really, really cool cards coming out. Beautiful photography. And of course, if you had missed the episode that we did uh, on the hobby box there, you will see the crazy pull that we had pulled. I'm not going to spoil it for you guys. You got to go check it out there for sure. Um, we are going to do a box war. Uh, we are going to do it Beat the Odds Card Break Cup style and as a draft. And we have a special guest with us here tonight. Um, the ever popular, ever beautiful, ever savvy, I'm not going to butter up here anymore here, it's Alicia. She's here with us tonight, she's going to be ripping beside us here. Um, first things first though, let's get these packages ripped open so we can start taking out the packs. We're going to get these all separated out by packs here. And we are going to pick these one by one. And so we have our draft. We're interrupting this program to give you a special announcement. We will be awarding the giveaways. We've got two uh, dice rolls to give away here uh, for the two episodes episodes that we had. So the first giveaway, we had two participants in it there, so 50-50 chance that someone's going to win a free, a free dice roll here. Let's see who's going to take it. We have between Rob, Powers, and Nugget. So let's just put this in here. And since today is the 20th, I think we're going to do this 20 times. Let's see, let's see uh, who ends up on top here. So let's go. Let's one, two... Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, and finally twenty. And the winner is Rob Powers. Congratulations. Feel free to reach out to me here, Rob. Um, and we will coordinate getting you a free dice roll. All right, so let's go back and run the second one here. This one we have five participants. Uh, same idea here, we're gonna do this 20 times. Um, here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, and finally twenty. And the winner is Toronto Sports Cards. Congratulations! Feel free to reach out to me here, and we will make sure that we can coordinate uh, a free dice roll here for you in one of our upcoming breaks. Thanks, guys, and let's return you back to the All show. All right, we have chosen the packs and we're going to kind of keep them uh, you know but i don't think we really need to keep them on screen there you guys should know we got both got eight packs we both got two stadium club chrome uh there's alicia's eight here's my eight and our two chrome packs we've got 16 20 packs uh to open here in this episode so basically pretty much a jumbo hobby box in the case of stadium club chrome um, before we get to the rip though, just a quick uh, reminder, we are getting close to 250 subscribers. Once we get to that mark, we are going to do a giveaway. One person is going to win that Boba Shet or their choice of either the Boba Shet or the Illusions Value Pack from 2019-2020 basketball. Let's move these off the screen. Very, grace, very grateful for all those who had uh, signed up to be a subscriber here and if you're watching and you haven't done that yet please do so you can be part of some amazing things here at Beat the Odds Card Breaks. We're gonna put our big hits on the board hopefully there'll be a lot of them. Um, 
for those who have yet to see the rules for this, I'll put them on the screen here for you. Uh, there are 20 names that we are chasing in the set and they are assigned point values 20 to one. If we pull one of them, we get those points towards our score. And then of course, if we get one of them in a parallel, then we will get a multiplier. Refractor and x is times two. Uh, gold is times 10, wave is times 20, red is times 50, and the auto is times 5. All right, let's get going here. Alicia's going to start us off with her first pack. Let's see if she can get something good to start here for her. So she's going to have, looks like a, oh my gosh, I can't see the names here, Trey Turner to start. And there's a nice rookie, TJ Zook, but he's not going to count. Oh my goodness, look at that. Right off the bat, there's a wave refractor of Travis Demerit. It's very, it's a very shame, very much a shame that uh, he's not included uh, in the top 20 because that would have been a sick card to pull. But nevertheless, we're going to put that one on the board because that's a really cool card. Uh, David Wright. And then there is a John Birdie rookie card. And the last card is a Ryan McBroom rookie card. So first pack had some nice cards come out there, but unfortunately nothing to score her any points. So she's going to take a zero for her first pack. And let's see if we can get something out of my first pack here. Looking, of course, hope, hoping maybe we can hit an auto. Oh, we got backwards cards everywhere. I don't know what's going on here. I think this one's supposed to be forward. Tyler Alexander rookie card here. So no points there. There's an Alex Gordon. And then I've got a refractor of Austin Hayes. Nice looking card there, but not going to score me any points. There's a Yusei Kikuchi. Uh, Yasiel Puig. And then the final card is a rookie card of Brian Abreu. So we skunk on both of our first packs here. The score remains 0-0. Zero, zero. I very much hope that that's not the score at the end because that will be kind of a waste of money. But uh, nevertheless, these, uh, these cards are really, really nice looking. So even if we don't hit anything super big here, I really won't be disappointed. Uh, but of course, you do hope to hit something kind of nice. Mark Hanna to start in this pack. There is a Lance McCullers Jr. And then we've got a Carter Kaiboom. That looks like a refractor there. Mm -hmm. And that's a Nick Solak rookie card. Uh, we've got a Scott Heineman rookie card. And then the final card is going to be Ricky Henderson. Nice. Uh, stealing, I believe that's the bag he stole when he took the stolen base crown. I have to take a look at that uh, image there a little bit closely, but I don't think there was another instance where he would have taken the bag right out of the field. Oh, another bunch of cards. I see a card in the back that I'm going to like and it's going to score me some points, so maybe I'll start from here. Uh, Sunny Gray, Will Clark, we've got a Brendan McKay. Uh, sorry, Brendan McKay. Emperors of the Zone card. Not a huge fan of that subset. Uh, Miguel Sano. There is an Eloy Jimenez. That's a nice card there. But the card in the back that I'm really excited about is a Jordan Alvarez. So there's first points on the board. I'm going to strike first here. Nice looking Jordan Alvarez. We're going to get a sleeve on that one. We actually should get a sleeve on the demerit there as well. But I'm going to take the points for Alvarez. That's going to be 13 to the score. Oops. I put that in the wrong section there. There we go. So now I've got a early lead. It is 13 to nothing. Nice card to start um, for the game here. Let's hope we can get some more. Still looking for, I think the only rookie base rookie card uh, that I haven't hit yet that's big, I believe, is the Bichette. So hoping we can get one of those here for good sentimental value. A sentimental value. I think I said that right. Eric Thames to start us off. Next card is a Gary Carter. Then we have Mike Schmidt, and that kind of looks like that's going to be a refractor. Yeah, there's a Yuan Moncada. After that, Max Fried and Luke Voigt. We've seen all those cards before. <laughs> so that was a pack that we are familiar with because we ripped some of these things off camera, and I think we had the exact same pack in one of those. 
So let's move on here. Oh, I'm going to score some more points in this pack. Uh, Adrian Morion. Murray Hone. Sam Hilliard, a rookie card as well. Uh, we have a Logan Allen, and I believe that's going to be a Refractor. So, Refractor rookie cards, I like that. We'll put that one actually on the board here for now. I doubt it's going to stay, but it can go there for now. Josh Van Meter, Ryan Braun, and then there's a Ronald Acuna. So, I will take the points for Acuna. He's going to score 14. That puts my score to 27. And Alicia's waiting to hit something on the board here. I know she's got something that's going to be huge coming out here. I did better off camera. Yeah, you kind of did. But we got uh, you still got a fair amount of packs to go. So let's let's hope that you get something nice here. Uh, let's see what we got. Austin Riley to start. There's a Junior Fernandez rookie card. And a Bean Team Shoei Otani. Nice looking card there. And then how about that? Fernando Tatis Jr. Power Zone. So you ended up with two inserts in the same pack. Again. That's pretty cool. So the uh, the Tatis will score you some points. AJ Puck. And then you actually got an extra card in there too. Tim Lincecum. And the final card is a Charlie Morton. So you got a seven card pack. And Tatis in there is going to score you 11, 11 points. You might as well put the Tatis on the board there. And you officially hit the board. I'll put them right in the middle. All right. Let us move on. Let's see if we can get something nice out of here. Dylan Cease, that's a good rookie card. And then there's a Carlos Correa. And we have a D Gordon. That's going to be your refractor. Sonny Gray. Ahmed Rosario. And Daryl Strawberry, the shirtless wonder. Put that one to the side. Nothing scoring points for me, so my score is going to hold a 27. It's currently 27 to 11. Let's see if we can get some more points out of... Alicia's pack here we have Joey Votto that's a cool looking uniform Byron Buxton and that's a Jose Altuve and that looks like that's going to be a refractor uh, Mitch Keller we have at Alberto Mondesi and the final card is going to be a Sheldon Noisy rookie card there so no points for Alicia that round she's got three packs left to go I've got four but this, uh, this can turn on a dime. See if I get something in here. Tom Eshelman to start. Ooh, that card is sticking to the back. Miles Michaelis. Then we've got a Gio Urshela. That's going to be a refractor. Refractor Gio Urshela. I will put that down to the side. Michael Brantley. Jackie Robinson. That's cool. And Jose Abreu to finish off that pack. So the cards have gone a little dry. Let's see if we can pick something else up here. Alicia is going to start us off with a Patrick Corbin. There's an Aaron Nola behind that. Looks like you're going to have an insert. Mike Trout. There you go. That's going to be a nice uh, score there for you. Uh, Jake Odorizzi. And then there is a... Uh, Zach Wheeler, and then the last card is a Frank Thomas. So that Trout's going to score you 15, and you are back into it. I've got a narrow lead. It is now 27-26. Actually, no, you might as well put that Trout on the board there, too. Maybe take off that Logan Allen. My card. And here we go. We have a Bob Feller. Uh, Nomar Garcia Para. Trevor Story is going to be the uh, refractor there. I'm going to score some points here with Dustin May. 
Um, yeah, you know what? I think I'm gonna take the Cunha off and put the May there. Ah. Abraham Toro rookie card and Charlie Blackman to finish off that pack. So the May is gonna score me eight. That's gonna push me a little bit further out. I got 35, so 35, 26. It's a nice close battle here. We're down to our last two packs each of base, and then we got two of the uh, chrome refractors to open up here. JP Crawford to start in this pack. There's a Jacob deGrom after that. Oh my goodness, look at that card. There's a Luis Robert refractor. Nice, nice hit. That is going to add 40 points to your score, and yeah, we're not wasting time. That is going into a sleeve and a top loader right away. Uh, nicest pull out of retail so far by far, and that's going to hit the best pull spot there. Nice, nice pull there. Jeff Bagwell, there's a Didi Gregorius, and then the final card is going to be a Kyle Garlic rookie card. So big hit there for Alicia, and she vaults herself into the lead. She's got 66 points. I'm going to need a hit of similar magnitude to make a comeback here. We'll see if I can get it. Jeff Bagwell, we have DJ LeMayhew, and then Emperors of the Zone, Chris Sale. That's not going to do it. Chris Sale, we'll put that one to the side. Francisco Mejia, there's an Austin Nola rookie card and a Cody Bellinger to finish off that pack. All right, we're down to our last uh, packs here for Stadium Club Chrome. I need a miracle. And if Alicia can keep uh, doing what she's doing, she should take the win here. She's going to start off with an AJ Puck. There is a Tyler Glass now and a Tom Eshelman. That's going to be a refractor. And then there's a Ryan O'Hearn. Uh, Kyle Schwarber. And the last card is going to be a Evan Longoria. So no points scored on that one. Gives me an opportunity maybe to get some of them back here in this pack. Let's see if I can. Uh, Austin Hayes, by the looks of it, is going to start us off here. There's an Edwin Encarnacion. And Adrian Morihan is going to be the refractor. Nice rookie refractor, but not going to score me any points. Tyler Alexander. Hey, there's a nice one. Randy Arons Arena. That's going to score me some nice points here. And then George Springer to finish off that pack. So we're going to get a sleeve on the Rose Arena. And that's going to hit the board here, I think, over the uh, Fernando Tatis. We'll pull that one off. I'll put the Arraz Arena on the board. Count a couple of extra points. That's going to be 18. It's going to bring my score to 53. So going to our refractors, um, we have a pretty decent lead, 66 to 53 for Alicia. Let's see if she can score a couple of nice ones here. She's going to start off with a JD Davis. And after that's a Marcus Semyon. Looks like they're kind of stuck together a little bit here. Uh, what do you got there? That's a Rod Carew. Nice looking card there, but not going to score you any points. And a Don Nunez rookie card. So nothing there. So her total is going to stay at 66. So let's move on to my pack here. Corey Seager to start for me. Oh, look at that. That's exactly what we were looking for right there. Luis Roberts. Not only did we get him in the refractor, we also got him in the uh, whatever you call this, X-fractor. So that one's definitely going to be hitting the board here too. Uh, Dario Agrizal and Chad Wallach to finish off that pack. Nice, 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 nice hit. All right, we got two packs left here, and now I've uh, retaken the lead, and you're going to need a pretty big score here to catch up. It's 93 to 66, and your first pack's going to have a Sam Hilliard uh, rookie card there. There's a Rangel Ravello rookie. Then there is a Randall Grichuk, and then the last card is going to be an Ozzy Albies, so nothing there. Unfortunately, that means uh, I'm going to take the win on this one, but really, we all win because we all get Luis Roberts 
uh, refractors out of these packs, which is fantastic. I was hoping for an auto, but I will definitely take the Luis Roberts over an auto any day. Yadi Molina. Oh my, these are sticky. Mark Hanna. Brian Abreu, rookie card. And then the last card of the break is going to be a Barry Zito. So no points for me there either. The final score is going to end up 93 to 66. That's how uh, it ends here tonight. I hope you guys enjoyed what you saw here. We do have a contest. The contest is pretty straightforward. You need to first be a subscriber. Uh, make sure you like the video and then leave a comment on what your favorite pull of the video was. And we will choose one person at random. That person is going to win a free dice roll on one of our upcoming live team breaks. If you haven't seen the live team breaks, please do check us out here on eBay. Of course, we've got uh, Instagram as well here. And, you know, obviously subscribe to the channel here on YouTube. Um, that's going to do it for us tonight, folks. Uh, thank you all for watching. We are going to sign off for now, but we are going to catch you guys here on the next episode. Uh -huh.